Hello everyone, I'm Pratik Luitel and today we're making anyone speak anything. By lip syncing, we'll be making deep fakes, so you can expect to see some talking memes on the way. We'll be using a tool named Wave to Lip on a Google Colab note, which means that you'll be able to follow along with nothing but your browser that you're currently using. No excuses allowed on this one. All this technique needs is a short video and an audio speech, and the speech determines what the person on the video is speaking out. That's it. That is the main idea. Before I get your hands all dirty, hold on to your horses to appreciate the work of the authors and the contributors who made this possible. Grab the first link in the description and that will direct you to the collab script. Following good practice, Make a copy of the script to your drive and make sure that the runtime is on GPU. The GPU that I'm referring to is on the cloud, so that is provided to you for free by Google. You'd like to execute the first cell. This setup sweeps to lip by taking care of all the code, its dependencies, and the pre-trained models. This will take some time. Mine took about 5 minutes to complete. Now, this collab script can make lip sync defakes from any YouTube video or from the video files that you have on your computer. The second cell takes the URL for any YouTube video. Let me paste a URL in this field. You need to make sure that every frame of the video has a face on it. It's unlikely that every frame of a YouTube video will have a face on it, so you can trim the video starting at some seconds and ending at some seconds of the video. Just execute this cell to download the YouTube video to Colab. When that is done, you can preview the trimmed video. The third cell takes your audio. You can either upload an audio file or record your voice by yourself. I am going to record right now. The moment you execute this cell, it will start to record and you will need to click a button that will appear to stop it. Here we go. A equals MC square. It means mass can be transformed to energy. And I see the madman, a little rocket man, packing quite a mass under his belly. Sorry for that. Finally, you'll get to preview your recordings. In the last cell, you can ignore or leave the settings for the most part. And just execute this cell to get cracking into the deep fake. This may take a few minutes depending on how long the lip sync is. Meanwhile, you'll want to note the length of the trimmed video and your audio. I recommend that the length of the trimmed video is equal to or longer than the audio. Also, there's a clever trick to get the fastest GPU provided by Colab. In this way, you'll get the results a lot faster. Just check the YouTube cards above to get to that video. After it's done, you can preview the deepfake right here. A equals MC square. It means mass can be transformed to energy, and I see the madman, a little rocket man, packing quite a mass under his belly. If you are willing to download the video, you can find it in this particular path. Once found, you can download it. Here's a tip for you. Notice the discontinuity between the lips and chin of Donald Trump. The fix is very simple. All I need to do is add some bottom padding. I'll set the pad bottom value to 30 and re-execute the cell. That fixes the issue. And finally, expand the last section which takes the video you upload instead from YouTube. Upload your video to Colab from your local computer. Copy the path to this video and paste it right here. When it comes to trimming the video, if you don't want to change anything, just use minus 1 in both the start and end fields. Finally, execute it. When it comes to audio, it is identical. You have two options. This time, I am selecting the upload option. You might want to execute this cell and then upload your video file. Similarly, the last cell is also identical. Just execute this to process the lip sync video. As this is on the progress, let me add some more tips for better results. This wave to lip model was trained on 720p videos, so dropping the resolution might get you visually pleasing results. So 
If you have 1080p video, you'll need to set the rescale factor to 2. Sometimes you see the mouth position dislocated or some weird artifacts such as two mouths. In such cases, you might want to check the no smooth option which might fix the problem. After all changes in the setting, you need to re-execute the last cell again. Once the lip sync is done, you can preview or download the video as usual. With the help of Wave to Lip, you can now sync lips to any dubbed movie, lecture or conference as if the person was himself or herself speaking the foreign language. Here is a comparison of Mona Lisa lip sync. On the left is the result from last year's state of the art lip GAN and on the right is the result of Wave to Lip. The examination and testimony of the experts enabled the commission to conclude that five shots may have been fired. It is obvious Wave to Lip outperformed and is significantly better. In case anyone wants to play with lip GAN, you can find the collab link in the description. Technology is getting better and it's getting hard to differentiate what's real and what's fake. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. In fact, we don't hold any responsibility for any wrongdoings from the tools learned from this video. <laughs> If you are curious how wave to lip works, there is a link to the paper in the description. I hope that you have fun. Please like and share if you enjoyed this video. And subscribe and ring that bell for more exciting videos to come. Like making 3D models from just a portrait or AI predicting someone's face from just their voice. All done in Google Colab. Thank you for watching.